Avery. <gasps> Avery, come here. Get out of there, Lottie. Come on, Lottie. Are you watching over your chickens? Morning, guys. Hey, my sweet babies. What are you doing? You ready for breakfast? Yeah. Let's get you breakfast. We've been spending the last couple of weeks getting a lot of the dead plants pulled out and some fall veggies put back in and re-cardboarding some of the places that would turn back to grass and we just were really struggling with. And we're going to use the weed suppression method all winter this time so that the weeds will really die and next year we won't have so much trouble. This is our Kajari melon. It's starting to take off. I don't know if we'll get anything off of it before our first frost, but hopefully. I love these beans so much. They're just beautiful. And they did such a good job. We really had a trouble with our beans this year, but this arbor did pretty good. And we started relaying compost over our cardboard in places. beauty of having animals so you don't have to worry about buying it you can just take it straight from your compost pile it's so pretty I love it on foggy mornings out here it's so magical oh, there we go find the puppies starting to walk around here we let them come out with us every Morning and every night to do chores. Oakley just took off with the big dogs so they'll get used to our chickens and ducks and so they all grow up together and we shouldn't have too much of a problem with them. They've been really good too. They just pretty much ignore them. I'm a little scared of them still but they're doing good. I like to follow Lottie around a lot. What have you boys been doing, huh? You having fun out here? Uh, you having fun? You're so sweet. You're so sweet.
I think this may be my favorite dahlia that we grew this year. It is so beautiful. You guys, I am obsessed with this marigold. We grew it last year for the first time. And it just has the most beautiful blooms. Look at that. It's called Mission Giant. We've got it tucked over here in our chapel garden with all of our zinnias and dahlias and cosmos. So pretty. Our garden is really quickly coming to an end this season. Hey puppy. All we've really got left are peppers, tomatoes, okra, and beans. And I am really sad to see it go. We've got some little things that are going to start replacing it for fall, but for the most part, our garden season is over for the year. Last week, we planted some root vegetables like carrots and beets and radish. We've also got some Chinese cabbage and lettuce. Something else going, I can't remember what it is right this second. The days are getting a little bit cooler, a little less humid, and it's starting to feel a little bit more like fall. And part of me is glad for the break, but a bigger part of me is really, really sad to see our gardening coming to an end. Hey Charlotte. Not too bad of harvest. Right, Averly? Oh, Oakley, excuse me. I keep calling these dogs the wrong thing. <laughs> oh, wow. Oakley! Such a big world to explore, huh? Yes. Healy puppy. They get a huge kick out of following our big dogs around, but they're not quite so sure about our chickens and ducks yet. His brother is down there with mom and Brianna. Oakley! Oakley! Who knew overalls made the perfect doggy pouch? <laughs> Who knew, huh?
sun has gone down and the puppies are tucked in the sleep in the living room. The chickens and ducks are all safely locked in their cages. And the harvest baskets have been brought in, so we are going to call it a night. Thank you so much for spending the day with us. Be blessed, and we will see you next time at the cottage. Bye-bye.